Hi guys, it's Paul Lynch here and I'm going to give you a live demonstration of Video Sketcher in action. Okay, I'm going to really show you what this amazing piece of software after nine months of blood, sweat and tears can do for you. Okay, so I'm just going to run through some of the key benefits. As you can see, I've got the software open on my desktop. Now, the first thing we've got here is a, a, a red record button. If we press that, the software has got an inbuilt mic recorder. So all you need to do is if you wanted to do your own presentations, your own uh, voiceovers, you just need to click this red button, speak into your laptop, okay, or headphones, and the software will record your voice. We then click the keep button, and then we can literally build a whole cartoon story around your own voice. Now, obviously you can upload professional voiceovers, we've got options for that in the members area, or you, let's just say you don't even need a voice, you just need music. You can upload your own music or you can use our music. So let's just say we're going to go down the music route, uh, so we just click the music button there. This, this then shows the library of all the music and we can just hear any one of these by clicking the test button. Okay, let's say we light, we light the first one, which is the rock loop. So we then click select and we click OK. So we have now chosen our music for our new cartoon video that we're going to make. All we need now is images. Now, before we get onto our stock images that we've got built into the software, we let you have the option of uploading your own images from your desktop. So let's just grab one of my images here. Okay, so that should put it on the canvas and then watch what happens when we click the play button. There we go. The the software will draw the image straight from your desktop. So we're just going to take that away because what I want to do is show you some of the images that are already in um, the software for you to choose from. So um, let's just go to social media. We'll grab a Facebook image. Just watch how simple and easy it is to resize the images, to move them where you want. So we'll put a Facebook image there. We, Because we want it to stay there, we click right click and we click fix camera. Okay, so we just quickly draw that. Let's have a look. Now, baby, you're thinking, mm, it's drawn that a little bit too fast. So all you need to do, right click, properties, and the effect, just make it draw it. A hell of a lot slower let's go for 15 seconds thereabouts now watch the watch the uniqueness of the drawing now nearly perfectly in time with the music so the point I'm trying to make is you can make the um, make the hand draw as quickly or 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 as as slowly as you like so just put that back down to 4 seconds cuz i'm just going to grab a lot i don't want to waste too much time on this because it literally uh we've got absolutely everything in here um let's just grab let's grab a british flag for for me we will put that let's put it on a bit of an angle like that we'll put it over there okay so right click fix the camera uh, let's grab a United States flag, which a lot of our customers are from the United States. Let's just put that in the corner there. Right click, fix the camera. Um, let's just... Uh, let's put a call out. We'll put a call out there. Eh? Uh, yeah, let's do a call out and... Just gonna right click so we'll move that there, we'll make that bigger. And then we'll fix the camera. We're gonna put some text. Uh need more room. Paul. So I'm just gonna put that down. Okay. So you can you can change the text or whatever you want as well. Every single font is in there. Uh, same with the colours, whatever colours you want to do, we'll just leave it like that for now. So double click and I'm going to move that over there so it fits in nicely. 
need more room Paul so we're going to fix the camera and then just watch how we how we play everything together <laughs> Now, obviously, you know, we can speed things up, slow things down to fit in with the music. That's what it's all about. But the reason I put that is, is what happens when we run out of space? So simple and so easy. In fact, just let me speed all these up before I do that. So I'm going to put that down to two seconds. I'm going to put that to two seconds. Put that to two seconds. Two seconds. And two seconds. That should speed things up. Okay, so because now we're beginning to run out of room, to, but you want to keep the video going because you've got lots more to do, all you do is you drag the images off the canvas and then we add the next image. So we add the next image. Let's just move that around. Fix camera. Add some more text. Okay, I'm gonna pull that in there. And fix the camera. Okay, so what we need to do on this is just click on request focus. Okay, now watch what happens. Can you see how it dragged the images off the canvas and we started on a brand new canvas and just keep the video going as long as you like it really is so simple there's lots of other things that that the software can do like different camera angles and stuff but that is how easy it is to create one of these cartoon videos now guys what I want to show you is real live proof and I want you to really think about this I'm going to go over to a website called whiteboardanimation.com now it I've been doing lots of research, not just on this company, but on all, all the companies that produce these videos. Now look at this one here. Uh, this particular style video is $1,800 per minute. Now I'm not going to get you to watch a minute's worth of one of their videos. I just want you to watch 30 seconds of this video. And bear in mind when you're watching, this 30 seconds would have cost you $900. Okay, just watch 30 seconds. So what exactly is employee engagement? Why is it critical to our business success? Why should I, as a business leader or a manager, care about it? Now over the next few minutes, we're gonna define it using our X model of engagement and talk about how we tackle engagement within our organization. Let's start by looking at what our organization is trying to achieve. Clearly our organization is working to reach success. Success is defined by our business goals Okay, guys, that were about 30 seconds. Remember, that would have cost you $900. Now, watch what I've done when I've with the piece of software, with the video sketcher, with our piece of software. Just look what I've done as a carbon copy of that 30 seconds. So what exactly is employee engagement? Why is it critical to our business success? Why should I, as a business leader or a manager, care about it? Now over the next few minutes, we're going to define it using our X model of engagement and talk about how we tackle engagement within our organization. Let's start by looking at what our organization is trying to achieve. Clearly our organization is working to reach success. Success is defined by our business goals. So guys, the question is, which one do you prefer? The one to the right that would have cost you $900 for 30 seconds, or the one to the left? which by the way took me less than five minutes to do and will cost you a one-off price where you can create as many of these videos as you like make them as long as you like for the rest of your life
and as you can see the video that we created has been downloaded as an mp4 so you can quickly and easily upload that to YouTube and it's compatible with any video hosting service however just watch this let me go to my desktop let me click here this is a piece of software and the video that we've just created I'm gonna drag and drop it there I'm gonna press upload I'm gonna come back in a moment when that's uploaded and show you how quickly and easily it is to embed on your website or to share around okay so as you can see the video has now been uploaded so I'm just going to take that down I've now logged in to the dashboard this is a fantastic ex extra piece of software that that tracks everything so we've had like two million views on our videos it tracks where all your traffic's coming from all your drop-off rates how to increase your audience blah 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 so I'm just going to go to files I'm just going to click into the video that we've just uploaded. Just watch how easy this is to get some embed code to put on your website to change around. So this is what the video will look like as we as it stands. Uh, you can put it on auto play, uh, so we can auto play it. Um, so we go to a player, we can pick different players. So I'm just going to pick this. Okay, then we can pick a different frame. So we've got the um, iPhone, iPad, or the big um, Mac screen. So we'll just leave that on the Mac screen. Then we just click finalize. Just save the video. Now look what happens here guys, you've got your embed code here, so all you do is copy and paste that into your website, into your blog, and the video will appear like it does here, or you've got a direct link where you can share the video with people. So we're just copying that into a browser, there we go. You can get rid of this title and stuff. And just look how amazing that looks now in, in that screen. So just play. So what exactly is employee engagement? Why is it critical to our business success? So that is live on the web for you to share around, do whatever you like. This extra piece of software is also available in the members area.